Hey guys and welcome once again to this channel if you have been here and if you haven't it is so very kind of you to pass by so this video is going to be super quick and super easy I'm going to be making these bookends which by the way I put on my husband's desk which is why you see games and not books but if you want to see how I made these then just keep on watching The first thing I'm going to be doing is painting my little figurines that I got at the Dollar Tree. Now I know that they have these in white and I think they have them in black as well. I think they are sold like that but I could only find them in gold which is why I have to spray paint them. And also just ignore that little thing on the side that is just a little sneak peek of next week's video which I had to paint so I figured I might as well paint them together. And this is the rest of the items that you're going to need. Now I'm going to take my frames and I'm going to trace them onto white card stock paper. Um, you could do this any color you want. Like if you had gold frames, for example, then you would need gold card stock, if you know what I mean. So I'm just tracing two of them because I am making two bookends. And then I'm going to take that card stock paper and I'm going to glue it to the back of the frame. So like where the stand is, I'm going to glue it there just to make the frame look more like a box as opposed to just a frame. You'll see what I mean in a little bit. And then I'm going to take the back of the photo frame and I'm going to trace that onto black cardstock or in this case I'm just using this plastic black folder that I have left over from one of my last DIYs if you guys saw the passport covers. I just didn't want to waste this material so I'm just tracing that on this but you could just use like black paper or any other type of like decoration you want this is going to be on the glass part of the frame so it is going to be visible as like part of the decoration since my little figurines are black i wanted to do this black as well especially because it's going on my husband's desk so it's going to be very manly and very minimalist and once i have all my four pieces traced i'm going to of course cut them and then i'm going to proceed to put the black parts inside of the frames like i mentioned they would be in the glass part of the frame and then i'm going to glue the white cardstock to the back of the frames and the last part is of course to attach the figurine to the frame so all i'm doing for that is placing some e6000 which is by the way the same glue that i've been using this whole time i'm placing a little bit of e6000 on the little booty of the figurine and then i'm also using hot glue the reason why i'm doing this is because the hot glue dries faster so it's going to attach the figurine to the glass but then the e6000 is more long lasting so it's going to make sure that it lasts a long time and that it doesn't fall apart too fast and once everything is dry, I'm completely done. So this is how the book ends turned out. I kind of love them actually. They are a little too manly for me, but they are not for me. So that's completely fine. You could get super creative with these. And yeah, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and also subscribe if you haven't already. Have a lovely Sunday and thank you so, so, so much for watching. Bye.